Did you know that your gut is home to trillions of microorganisms? These microorganisms make up your gut microbiome and play a vital role in your health. Dr. Will Bulsowitz's book, Fiber Fueled, delves into the world of gut microbiome and explains why it's essential to keep it healthy. Your gut microbiome is responsible for various functions in your body, including digesting food, producing essential vitamins, and even influencing your mood and mental health. A healthy gut microbiome has been linked to a lower risk of chronic diseases, such as obesity, type 2 diabetes, and even certain cancers. So, how do you keep your gut microbiome healthy? The answer is simple. Eat a wide variety of plants. Dr. B explains that a plant-based diet is the best way to feed your gut microbiome with the fiber and nutrients it needs to thrive. The book also includes practical tips on how to incorporate more plants into your diet and delicious plant-based recipes in the Fiber-Fueled Cookbook. In summary, Fiber-Fueled is a fascinating read that introduces you to the world of gut microbiome and its importance for your health. By following the advice in this book, you can take charge of your health and create a healthy gut microbiome, leading to a happier and healthier life. Idea 1. The amazing diversity and importance of your gut microbiome. Your gut microbiome is the collection of microorganisms that live inside you, including bacteria, viruses, fungi, parasites, and archaea. The genetic makeup of this microbiota is referred to as the microbiome. The gut microbiota is critical to your digestive function and plays a vital role in your immunity, metabolism, hormonal balance, cognition, and gene expression. Research in the field of microbiome is growing at an exponential rate with 12,900 papers published in the last five years, which is 80% of all papers published about the gut microbiome in the last 40 years. And in the last 15 years, the number of bacterial species in the human gut has increased from 200 to 15,000, with an estimated 36,000 species yet to be discovered. Bacteria are the most well-known microbes in the gut, and while some can cause illness, most are beneficial to our health. Fungi and viruses can also be good or bad, depending on their interaction with the other microbes. Parasites in the gut can steal energy from the host, but most are asymptomatic. Archaea are ancient organisms that are resilient and barely understood. The diversity of your microbiota is unique, with each person having from 300 to over 1,000 of the possible 36,000 species. Your food choices affect the evolution of your gut microbes, giving you a particular set of microbes that is as unique as your fingerprint. Dysbiosis, or a lack of balance in your gut microbiota, can lead to a loss of diversity of species, which can cause inflammation and bacterial endotoxin to enter the bloodstream. This inflammation is linked to many diseases, including autoimmune diseases, obesity, coronary artery disease, type 2 diabetes, and Alzheimer's. Therefore, it is important to maintain a healthy gut microbiota by avoiding factors that can disrupt the balance, such as antibiotics, high sugar diets, stress, and lack of sleep. A healthy gut microbiome is essential for overall health and well-being. Idea 2. Healing your gut. Kristen's story is unfortunately all too common. She suffered from a range of health issues, from chronic abdominal pain and diarrhea to migraines and polycystic ovary syndrome. Despite trying various diets and eliminating certain foods, she still struggled to find relief. Dr. B recognized that Kristen's issues were likely connected to her gut health, which is a common issue for many patients. Our modern lifestyle has led to an increase in health problems related to poor gut health. We are overfed, undernourished, and often rely on prescription medications to address symptoms rather than addressing the root cause of the problem. The use of antibiotics, in particular, can have a significant impact on gut health, as they can decimate our gut microbiota. Diet also plays a significant role in gut health. Many Americans consume a diet that is high in animal protein and processed plants, with little emphasis on whole grains, fruits, vegetables, nuts, and beans. This type of diet can lead to an increase in inflammatory microbes and a decrease in anti-inflammatory species. Sugar and refined carbohydrates can also be harmful to gut health, as they lead to a loss of diversity in gut microbes and an increase in inflammatory bacteria. Additionally, 
Preservatives, additives, and colorants found in processed foods can also harm gut health. The solution to these issues is to address the root cause of the problem and heal our guts. This may involve making changes to our diets, reducing our reliance on prescription medications, and avoiding harmful additives and preservatives in our food. By taking steps to improve our gut health, we can improve our overall health and well-being. Idea 3. The Power of Fiber for a Healthy Gut Microbiota Are you looking to improve your gut health? One of the most effective ways to do this is by increasing your dietary fiber intake. Fiber, a complex carbohydrate found in plants, is essential for a healthy gut microbiota. Your microbiota, which contains over 60,000 enzymes capable of processing fiber, breaks down fiber to produce short-chain fatty acids SCFAs. These SCFAs promote a healthy colon and suppress dangerous bacterial strains like E. coli and Salmonella. To alleviate a dietary fiber deficiency, it is important to diversify your plant intake and aim for a diet that is at least 90% plant-based. To achieve maximum gut microbial diversity, aim to eat 30 different plants each week, including fruits, fermented foods, greens and whole grains, omega-3 super seeds, aromatics, legumes, and sulforaphane containing cruciferous vegetables. Combining many plants can create a powerful synergistic effect, enhancing the absorption of essential nutrients like iron. And don't forget to share your microbes with others. Spending time with others and even sharing a kiss can help maintain a healthy gut microbiota. In conclusion, fiber is a powerful solution for restoring the health of your microbiota. By incorporating a diverse range of plant-based foods into your diet, you can improve your gut health and overall well-being. Summary. Fiber is an essential component of a healthy diet, yet many Americans fail to meet the recommended daily intake. This shortfall can have significant consequences for our gut microbiota and overall health. To address this, incorporating a variety of fiber-rich foods into our diets is crucial. One simple way to do this is by eating the rainbow of fiber-fueled foods. The F Goals acronym represents the different categories of these foods, including fruit, fermented foods, greens, whole grains, omega-3 super seeds, aromatics, legumes, and sulforaphane-rich cruciferous vegetables. Adding in mushrooms and seaweed can also provide additional benefits. Incorporating a variety of these foods into our daily diets can have tremendous health benefits, including supporting our gut microbiota, promoting digestive health, and reducing the risk of chronic diseases such as heart disease and diabetes. Furthermore, it's essential to remember that our gut microbiota is a crucial component of our overall health. To maintain a healthy gut, we can share our microbes with others through physical contact such as handshakes, high fives, and even kissing. So not only are we boosting our own health by eating a fiber-rich diet, but we're also sharing the love with those around us. Now, thank you for taking the time to watch, and if you found value in this video, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. And in case you want to buy the book, use the link in the description. Trust me, you won't regret it.